she is our little miracle. A baby girl from Florida defying death with help from doctors at Boston Children's Hospital. Before Abigail Jones was born, her parents, Erica and Stephen, were given a devastating diagnosis about a tumor found on her brain. We had been told since I was 30 weeks pregnant that this is fatal, this is going to kill her. They set us up uh, with pediatric hospice. Um, we made uh, funeral arrangements for Abigail. When she was born in August with both Down syndrome and the tumor, Abigail's parents and big sister cherished every second, taking these newborn photos that went viral along with their story. But as days passed and Abigail stayed strong, Erica and Stephen started to question the diagnosis. She was thriving. She was certainly not in any way, shape, or form dying. That's when Erica reached out to doctors at Boston Children's Hospital. We thought there wasn't enough evidence to give her a death sentence. I said, why don't you come on up, let's take a look at this thing, and maybe we can take it out. That was really the first time that we had hope. We had hope. Holding on to that hope, Abigail and her parents flew up to Boston so that Children's Neurosurgeon-in-Chief Alan Cohen and his team could perform the surgery. When Dr. Cohen came out of the surgery and said, we got it all, and we are pretty, pretty, pretty sure that it's not malignant, it's not cancer. Um, it was almost like she was born again, she had a life now. A life that her parents hadn't allowed themselves to even think about until now. I just look at you and I think about your life and what you're going to be like when you're one and what you're going to be like when you're two and that we need to go home and make you a nursery and get you a crib and all that kind of stuff. 